Now, I've been assured by Brian Hackney that sun will come out tomorrow. Whether we see it or not is a whole different story. It'll be better tomorrow than it was today. Good. So it's a step in the right direction. Uh, and Sunday will be even better. So the, the news is getting slowly, progressively more favorable. Not so much for the firefighters in the next 24 hours. I'll show you that. First, let's show you this. The uh, air quality is still out to lunch. Uh, this is the Santa Clara Valley. You can't see it from Lick Observatory with all of the smoke and the haze over the Golden Gate Bridge as well. Right now, it is still warm. Concord's got 94 in San Francisco at 77, and in San Jose, 93 degrees right now. Still, speaking of steps in the right direction, we did take a few baby steps toward cooler readings today. Numbers are one to five degrees cooler than they were yesterday at this time. Heat advisory is still in effect. Uh, through, uh, the, well, actually just uh, will shortly expire, but the red flag warnings are up through 6 o'clock tomorrow morning. The winds are going to be a problem. Northwesterly winds driving some of the flames toward some of the more populated areas up around Napa and Sonoma. Winds are only to 15 to 30 miles an hour at the higher elevations out of the northwest. That's at least a more moist direction, but yeah, wind velocity is what they're worried about. They've already got the dry fuels. The winds don't help, and they will not uh, tomorrow afternoon. Air quality has suffered. Visibilities right now are way down. They will improve a little bit tomorrow, but the air quality forecast spare the air alerts posted right through Tuesday. So it is bad in the North Bay, not so good in the East Bay, but closer to the shoreline and around the Bay shoreline in the South Bay tomorrow, it'll be an improvement. Satellite and radar shows high pressures put a cap on top of all the pollution, and it's going to keep things uh, on the hazy side for Saturday. It'll be better on Sunday. Forecast highs do come down to about 96 in Santa Rosa, 98 at Fairfield, in Livermore, 95 tomorrow. So at least we're back out of the triple digits. And those numbers that are in the mid 90s tomorrow for forecast highs will be back down into the mid 80s by Monday. So Sunday will be distinctly cooler, back into the mid 80s. We'll keep them in the 80s all week next week. Uh, around the bay, it'll be in the mid 70s, and around the beaches, we'll be in the 60s. And that's a whole world of difference from where we were yesterday, and in fact, from where we were today. So things are getting better, but not dramatically. For the drama, we're going to have to wait until next weekend.